Victory. Everybody wants it. Everybody's excited about that moment. Everybody wants the championship. Everybody wants to be on the other side to where they can say that they've overcome, that they've won. But doesn't victory mean that there's a battle somewhere? Doesn't victory mean that you've gone through something, that you've experienced pain before you can ever celebrate the purpose? You have to have battles in order to experience those victories. And that's what we all have. Jesus didn't lie to us, did he? In John 16, he said, in this world, you will have trouble. But guess what? You can have a perspective of victory in the middle of your battle because if it's not good yet, God's not done yet. He said, all things work together for good for those who love God and are called according to what he's calling you to do. Those who are called and justified and redeemed and glorified, listen, victory is already yours and you need to have that perspective in the middle of your problem. Your pain should just be something you look at that's gonna be something that catapults you to your purpose. Do not give up, do not give in, do not throw in the towel. I've been through it myself. My misery has become the ministry and that's the same thing that can happen for you. In fighting your battles, we're gonna put them up, we're gonna throw blows and we're gonna knock the enemy down so that he knows that we are moving forward from defeat to champions so that we can celebrate together. Let's go.